Hey guys, Jason here. Welcome to Carvaco Hacks. Today's hack is cleaning up vectors with the spline tool. I just imported an SVG of my logo. This is an older version of my logo that was pretty messy and it's really wobbly. It's not clean and you get this a lot sometimes when you create a vector from a photo. And I'm going to show you how to clean that up really quick with one of the most powerful tools that many people may not know about and that's the vector spline tool. All you need to do is highlight the vectors you want to clean up. Go to Vector, Spline Vectors, and hit Spline. And you can clean those vectors right up. So to explain what the Spline Vector tool actually does, if you click on a vector and go to Node Editing, you can see that a lot of the curves and the lines are made up of a lot of real tiny nodes. And what the Spline Vector tool is going to attempt is to reduce the amount of nodes and create smoother lines. The tolerance you set is how closely it'll try to follow those lines. Let me show you that. Depending on what tolerance you use is how closely it's going to try to follow the current lines. And if you put too large of a number, a lot of the bumps will stay there. And if you put too small of a number, it will try and round it out. If we click spline, you can see it did a pretty good job of cleaning it up. If we undo that and we change, let's reduce that to 0 0.01. We're going to spline that again. You can see that it rounded it out. We undo that, and this time we're going to add a zero, 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 0001, and we hit spline. You can see that it didn't take all the bumps out. But 0 0.001 seems to be the magic number, and that fixes most of the issues. Hope that helps, guys. We'll see you on the next hack. Thanks for watching Carvaco Hacks.